Hello everyone. In this video, I will discuss about on off delay timer block. That means in one single function block, we will have both on delay timer and off delay timer. Open your PLC software. On the left side, scroll down and under timer section, select on off delay block and click here and give the comment means block name on off timer okay if you see this block is having one input which is trigger and one output so i will take one input and connect this one i will select i3 and give the command this is my input and take one output connect and write comment output okay now open your plc hardware and download the program if you don't have the hardware with you do the simulation by pressing the simulation option also share our videos and channel with your friends so that these videos will reach wider audience and also follow our social media networks so that you will receive the updates immediately now i will go to online I will select IP address, press OK. As we discussed, there are two timers, right? On delay and off delay. That means we have to enter two timer values, one for on delay, second for off delay. So open the block properties and if you see there are two parameters, one is on time th and off time tl. So for on timer, on delay timer, I will take 5 seconds and for off delay timer, I will take 8 seconds. That means the on will be delayed for 5 seconds and off will be delayed for 8 seconds. Now we will check the logic. I will turn on the input i3. Then the timer will start. Our on delay time is 5 seconds. So after 5 seconds, the output will be on. So I will turn on the input i3. The timer started. After it reaches 5 seconds, the output is on. The output 1 is on. Okay. Whenever the input changes from high to low state, 1 to 0, then the off delay timer will be initiated. See, I will turn off the input i3. The off delay timer is started. Whenever it reaches 8 seconds, the output will be off. So this is the on and off delay timer. You can set the required parameters here. Let's say on is 10, off is 14 seconds. And you can start the input i3. Again, on delay timer is started. We set 10 seconds, so after 10 seconds, 
the output is on. Whenever the input I changes from high to low, off delay timer is initiated. The off will be delayed for 14 seconds in this case. Like that, you can delay the on time and off time as per your requirement. If you have any experience with the on and off delay timer blocks, share with us where you use this type of function and what is the process application with us through the comment section. Thank you. I will meet you in the next session.